I am way overdue in making a guacamole video. It's Connor! Wait, why am I here? I challenge Connor to a guac off. Bring it. This is the guac off. His way and her way. So we'll each start with some basic ingredients. His way also adds cherry tomato, garlic, cumin, red pepper flakes, and salt. Her way adds the magical combo of bacon and blue cheese, and of course, a little salt and pepper. Guac off. If I had to say there was a secret ingredient, it's cumin and chili flakes. All right, Katie's turn. Ready to watch her lose? You are such a punk. I'm just a winner. Hearing all of Connor's trash talking made me a little nervous. He makes a really good guacamole, but I'm bringing my A game, i.e. bacon. Adding the bacon and blue cheese, it's important to do it at the end and then to fold it in. You don't wanna smash this beautiful stuff. I'm feeling this. This is good. Connor's going down, you guys. I would like to introduce to you all our guest of honor, Judge Bradley. Hello. <laughs> Holy guacamole! First up, Connor's. I could taste the lime forward, and I like the chunkiness of the cherry tomatoes. Next, Katie's. I like the complexity of it. The Blue cheese and the bacon. Now, it's hard to go wrong with bacon. I, I also thought that it, it had a, a nice spiciness to it that, uh, yeah, I think the serrano pepper was, uh, was a nice touch. After deliberation, I love me some avocados and I think that Katie's is the winner. Well done. Great job. And don't forget, guys. Keep it quirky. You know it. Bye. I would argue that I actually am so intimately familiar with avocados, you know, their flavor, their texture, things that taste really good with them, that um, I forget what I was going to say. Your <laughs> talking is as good as your avocado grinding, then I'm not worried. 